Hi, so this week Philips have released a brand new version of Pronto Edit Professional, that's version 2.4.18. So head over to the Philips Pronto website, uh, it needs a registration but it's free, and grab the, grab the new version of the editor software. You'll also need to grab the new firmware while you're there, that's the new firmware for the TSU9600. And uh, on the bottom you'll also notice a link to Sonos. This is a new free Pronto script module to control the Sonos music system. Have a look through the the web page there. Um, this all comes as part of the new feature, which is a uh, UNP and uh, UPnP and DLNA support, which is added to a host of new features in the Pronto Edit Professional. So, import and merge the file. Go to the Pronto Script tab at the bottom and just drag and drop it onto your tree view. Uh, we've added it to the Listen to Music activity uh, in our file. And as you can see, it switches the amp over and uh, starts hunting on the IP network for the uh, zone players or zone bridges. So we've got three zones currently at home. Um, it doesn't seem to pick up the zone name, just uh, identifying them by IP address. But as you can see, uh, once you've uh, found your, your own zone and you've logged into it, everything seems to work pretty much as you'd expect. You can add and remove things to your queue. Uh, change zone players. The, the album art does appear, it takes a little second to appear. Next track, previous track, all that stuff seems to work uh, pretty well. What doesn't work uh, so well is uh, anything uh, in the search side of things, anything intensive. I've speeded this up a little for the input, but we're searching for Coldplay. Um, and this is in real time, and I think we timed it a full 20 seconds to uh, search through around 35,000 track library but uh, pr pretty poor. This is obviously an, an early version of this uh, free module 2 and things will, will no doubt improve. But uh, eventually, 20 seconds later, boom, we found the artist. Now just to give you a comparison, here's the same search on the desktop uh, software, on the, on the Mac in this case. Coldplay, boom, instantaneously found it. There's your results. So, not really sure what's going on, but uh, it's much slower. There's the same results found on the TSU, you can notice that the, the scroll wheel works there as well. So there you are, it's free I suppose, you can't uh, you can't knock it, it's never going to replace your uh, proper Sonos controller though. Remember to pop over to automatedhome.com and check out the rest of the details. Thanks. <laughs>